Welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 2. We are currently hopping around rocks on our hammerhead because I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. How about over there? Ooh, made it. Hey, I see antenna. That's a good sign. Some sort of man made structure. Here we go. Or not. I'm stopped by an invisible wall. I guess I'm not supposed to go that way. Why is that even there then? Where am I going? Ah. Oh, wait. I think I see something down there. And something over there. Oh, oh, oh! Can I make it? Can I make it? Oh no! 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 Fire is bad! Fire is very, very bad. Oh, can I make it over there? Oh, saved my butt. I thought I was gonna burn like a s'more. Marshmallow over a campfire. You know, you understand what I'm saying. Okay, let's try this again. Everyone in the car with me has a horrible headache. They're like, do you have to hit every pothole on the way there? Alright. I'm not going to bother with you guys. I don't want to fall and burn. This is where I think I'm supposed to go. Research base entrance. Ha ha! Success! Press F to exit Hammerhead. So I'm actually getting out on foot. Ah, I remember now. Let's see. Where are we headed? Up here. Let's go through here. And safe. Let's get money. 250 credits. That's it? What a jip. Uh, we have detected a site of incredible significance located beneath the volcano. This unpredictable terrain will make the retrieval of any data extremely hazardous. This way. Uh, this way? Uh, pitchfork goes to pitchfork. Thingy goes to thingy. Hey, they're right next to each other. Dreidel goes to dreidel. Nice. C goes to C. Paddle goes to paddle. Hey. That was an easy one. Let's see. What are you? You're nothing. Aha! What are you? You're just iridium. Is that it? Okay then. What's over here? Computer console. I was right. This site was a roadmap leading to the main Prothean ruins. Dr. Aloy and I agree that this must remain a secret at all costs. I will not allow another Eden Prime to occur. The Reapers, all of them, they must be stopped. How do I have the Tempest? Oh, I'm going to have to change that. Okay. What's this? Terminal. 
the hellish planet is a star map that points to a Prothean site of major significance. Dr. Oloy and I have mere hours to retrieve all we can before the conditions become too dangerous to continue. We learn too late that the local volcanic instability is magnified by our power grid. If we only had more time to study this, I'm sure the key to unlocking everything is here. Everything! Damn this planet! Alright, I'm not the best dramatic reader. Sue me. Uh, and what's this do? Oh, of course, that's the button that makes everything go to hell. Oh. I like how they look at each other for a second and go, uh, we got to go. God, Shepard, can you go anywhere without breaking things? You remember that conversation we had earlier about self-control? You did not listen to me, did you? This, sh this facility was doing fine until you pressed that button, and now it's going to come crashing into the lava. Shepard, I've said it again, and I will probably say it... I've said it before, and I'll probably say it many times again, but you are a dick. Seriously, you gotta... You, we just can't have nice things, Shepard. You gotta break them all. This is why I don't have China and the Normandy. Okay, gotta get out of here fast, fast, fast. Whoa. Fly like the wind. Very fast wind, not the jo slow, gentle wind that you have on summer days. I mean, like, hurricane wind. Let's go! No, we don't need resources, we need to go! Speedy, speedy, speedy. Alright, oh! Ow. Okay. That's it? Wow. Once again, an entire side mission where the whole point of it was for Shepard to break everything there. First he goes to that abandoned ship and all he does is throw it off the cliff. Now he goes to that research station and all he does is throw it into the lava. Such a dick. Alright, retrieved data, experience gained, some 1500 credits gained, ooh. Shepard, I swear to god, I am gonna duct tape, like, bubble wrap to your hands or something. It wouldn't stop you, but at least it might slow you down. Alright, where to now? Uh, I think we have one more Firewalker mission. Okay. Never mind. We got an urgent message from the elusive man. Oh, before I do that, I'm gonna change my advanced power. Why? Because I know what's coming, even if you don't. And I want warp ammo. Now, this ability here, dominate. Brainwash an organic enemy, forcing him to attack his allies. It's just like hacking for AIs, for synthetics, but it works on organics. And sometime I've considered going through the game with this Dominate and see if the entire game is as easy as that level we just did. But I think I'd get too bored with it after a while. Anyway, right now I need warp ammo. And level you up to the number three so that I do 35% damage. Good. Now let's go see what the elusive man wants. Oh, wait, wait. What am I doing? I'm not going there. Go in here. He's standing for once. Shepard, we got a break. Getting his exercise. I a distress call from a Torian patrol. They stumbled onto a collector ship beyond the Corlys system. 
The Torians were wiped out, but not before they crippled the Collector vessel. I need you to board that ship and get some hard data on the Collectors. Find us a way to get to their home world. Hard to imagine how a Turian patrol could take out a Collector ship. Reports indicate the hull's intact, but all systems seem to be offline. They could be making repairs as we speak. I'm not saying it won't be dangerous, but we can't let an opportunity like this slip by. My suit's snazzier than yours. If they had a patrol out there, why aren't the Turians sending a recon team in? They will, eventually. But I intercepted the transmissions. In the meantime, we're feeding them false reports. You're close enough that you can be in and out before the Turians learn the truth. Are you sure this information is good? Information is my weapon, Shepard. It's good. Pfft. Yeah, if I trusted your information. Um... I mean, he's already lured collectors to colonies and stuff. Alright. Send me the coordinates and I'll take care of it. Already sent. Once you're aboard the ship, establish an uplink with Edie. She'll mine their data for information regarding the Omega-4 relay. Good luck, Shepard. Coordinates punched in. Let's go find us a collector ship. Yay! We're gonna go find a ship and go inside it. You know, three of us against an entire ship. That seems like a smart idea. Okay, I am going to take Tali, our newest team member, and oh dear god, as much as I hate to say it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take Miranda. Ugh. Because she has warp, and warp is very effective against barriers. It pains me to do this, though. Okay. Uh, heavy warp. And... At least she'll give me some more extra weapons damage. Let's see. Uh, what do I want? Arc projector? I don't know. Maybe I want... Particle beam? Uh, is Arc Projector good against barriers? Let's see, hang on. Uh, da -da 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 -da. uh, sure, let's try this. The particle beam took too long last time. Who knows? Um. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and in this episode. Almost ended here. Let's go ahead and get inside the collector ship. We have a visual on the collector ship, Commander. Very low emissions. Passive infrared temperatures suggest most systems are offline. Thrusters are cold. That thing is massive. How the hell did the Turians take it out? He's not kidding, that's a big ship. Ladar scans do not detect any hull breaches on the side facing us. I detect no mass effect field distortions. It appears the drive core is offline. Rendezvous in 30 seconds, Commander. Good luck. Never seen a ship like this before. Looks like a giant insect hive. Penetrating scans have detected an access node to uplink with collector data banks. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and in this episode here. Thank you for watching. Join me next time.